Hey guys, this is the carving for the mandibular right lateral incisor and here is the wax block with marked midline and crown and root length and divided three thirds of the crown with the measured mesodistal and labiolingual dimensions. The mandibular lateral incisor is comparatively larger than the mandibular central incisor the only difference so we can proceed with the steps of the mandibular central incisor here we go for the mesodistal dimension of the crown we have to take 4.0 mm at the cervix and 5.5 mm at the contact area so we have to remove the excess part to get a trapezoid we have got the trapezoid for the buccolingual diameter of the crown we have to take 6.5 mm at the contact area and 5.8 mm at the cervix and we have to remove the excess part to get a flatter labial surface at the incisal third and slight convex at the middle and cervical third. In case of mandibular lateral incisor, we'll make the developmental depression
the root of the mandibular lateral incisors have pronounced developmental depressions on mesial and distal aspect we have to carve that so this was the carving for the mandibular right lateral incisor and watch my next video for the carving of mandibular right canine stay tuned